Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Stan Share, and today we're going to do a quick visit to the Lexus Performance Driving School Experience. I believe it's called Hashtag Drive Amazing. It's a Lexus event where you get to drive all the cars. You get to drive the newer NX models. Uh, you're gonna get to drive the, I, um, the IS500, uh, all the F Sports. They have a lifestyle section here. They have a, a section which goes over the brand new beautiful LX600. And you're gonna get to also drive the RC500. I mean, some incredible pieces of machinery here. I think it's cool the Lex did it. So follow me on this journey. It's gonna be a fun video. So I'm at the Hashtag Experience, Lexus Experience Drive event in New Jersey. And you gotta take a look at this bathroom. Even the porta potties are nicer than my bathroom in my freaking house. I mean, it's quite a porta potty. Look at that. They keep it very classy. This is how you flush the toilet with the thing. I mean, that's awesome. Yeah, so we're over here at MetLife Stadium in New Jersey. And uh, you got all these cool cars right here. Let's just keep some classy. I just told you the bathroom uh, is uh, the porta potties are like they're called them executive toilets. Nicer than my house. As you can see here, we got some cool cars. Hashtag drive amazing. It's all Lexus up in here. I'm gonna go get some water in a second. I mean, they just keep it classy. It's funny. I just came from Ray Katina Lexus, dropped off my Lexus. My RX350 for some tire and wheel service, and I'm driving a loaner. I'm actually driving one of these as a loaner right now. And the thing is, they keep these things classy. I mean, hope they got the LS uh, LX600 because I I'm trying to drive one. But I mean, look at these things. This is just this is gonna be a lot of fun. What's even more cool is that all the RCs are there. Got all the RC. 300s, the RCF, the IS500. I mean, as you can see here, they got all of these cool cars. Lexus has been making some really cool cars lately. You know, for years I was kind of like, ah, eh, Toyota. I'm, I don't want to be an old man, but here I am, about to be 39 in a couple weeks, and I've been driving a Lexus for two and a half years now, and I just love these things. The reliability aspect of it. I mean, this is just going to be a really cool event. Like I said, we're going to keep it classy. We're going to we're going to get some water to be hydrated. Just came fresh out of breakfast, so we're not quite hungry. But I mean, yeah, man, this is going to be really cool. I love this thing. This thing is just absolutely. This is the IS five hundred F Sport. It's actually the first time I get to see one in person. Lexus Performance Dragon School. Actually, I wonder if I can roll in that. That'd be kind of cool. This looks like the newer... Oh, this is the LS600. LS500, sorry. LS500 all-wheel drive. And this thing's gorgeous. This is bad ass right here. RCF. Tell me this thing's not beautiful. Look, look at this. Look at this thing. It's got the red leather gut. Let me know in the comments. What's your favorite Lexus? Yeah, these things are cool. Lexus up in here. Uh, for two fuel engines and two hybrid engines. The fuel engine that you're driving now is an inline four turbo with 278. Looks Most of you in uh, these vehicles have the Mark Levinson sound system. It is the up level sound system at Lexus, has 10 speakers and 1800 clear watts. Navigation system screen. This is awesome. Gotta tell you, I'm driving a, an, a loaner NX300 base, but this thing is absolutely gorgeous. Wow. I just drove it and it actually drives nice. It handles real nice. I mean, this thing's cool. Look at the rims on it. I 
obviously like I said it's the half sport beautiful car beautiful car I guess when it's time for me to upgrade my daily I might have to do that yeah I'm about I'm about to drive this RCF this is cool yeah I just took the RC out this thing is badass at its finest now we're going for the IS 500 F sport look at this thing yeah listen all I can say about this is that it's about time Lexus stepped up and made cars like this. This thing will compete with any German Italian car. I mean, that IS 500, the RC 500, I mean, incredible. I think I'm in love with Lexus even more. All right, so this car was really nice. It's an LX 600. I can see why they're selling them 20 to 60 grand over sticker. It probably was the nicest SUV I've ever driven in my life. Um, and then again, it is a Lexus and nothing gets smoother than this. Figure I'd take this RCF out, why not? Take this thing out, lifestyle drive. Nothing too crazy, have sport. You know what, this is the perfect combo for myself. Anybody that knows me knows what it's all about. Look at those sport pedals. Let's have fun. Put my glasses on, it's really nice and hot. It's about time we got this nice hot weather in New Jersey. And so, as you can see here, but right by Mount Life Stadium. I was just here uh, last summer for a Guns N' Roses show. But anyway, what do I think? What do I think of Lexus as a brand? Well, let's see. I'm on my second Lexus, right? I guess in my total family, we've had three. So what do I think? I love it. For a while there, you know, I was a little bit of a younger whippersnapper. I uh, was like, ah, Lexus, old man, right? That was kind of my thing. Especially a couple years ago when I had a BMW, performance-based BMW. But I gotta say, I guess maybe I'm getting older. I do drive a little slower. I do feel like Toyota and Lexus in general, you actually become a little bit of a different driver, maybe safer. Um, but those, uh, that IS500, that RC500, I mean, those things are straight beast mode. Um, and I gotta tell you something, I'm really blown away by what the brand is doing. I'm blown away by they're competing with the German cars. Like, you know, I was going around saying like, oh, you know what? I still wouldn't get this because it's not like an Audi or it's not like a, a BMW, like, oh, the M4, like, right? But I got to tell you something. It's a good thing I got to come drive these cars because I was really blown away. I mean, I was driving in cones and I took, I got a chance to punish the car as little or as much as I possibly was allowed to. I know there's more to it because they... Uh, set up the cars the way so we, nobody goes nuts, but we got to drive some of these cars and it's funny because um, Look what I'm driving today. I'm driving a base model NX uh, What is the NX 300 shout out to Ray Katina? It's a courtesy loaner car Ray Katina Lexus of Freehold. I got my car there for service I got my own Lexus from there great dealership. My car is over there right now getting an oil change uh, We're replacing a key fob. We're getting a new tire and so they gave me a loaner car for the weekend and I'm driving this and I got to tell you um, This car is not quite the NX. I drove an NX F Sport um, Newer, I mean you could tell the cars even the Lexus badge was different on that. Okay, it's actually some Lexus So it was a little different um, You know a little di different body style a little newer, but I got to tell you something. This is a beautiful car I like the white with the brown I mean, overall, you know, it's a Lexus kind of day for me. As usual, I'm impressed with the service that I got from my local Lexus dealer. I've been shopping there for a long time. My dad used to work for them many, many years ago. And uh, so I like the brand. I like where they're going with the performance-based cars. I drove that LX600, which I'm on the hunt for. And uh, let me tell you something. I've never driven a nicer SUV truck in my life. A gentleman just showed me all the ins and outs of it. Beautiful, beautiful car. So in the end, what do I think of, number one, this event. This event was incredible. Let the car cool down a little bit. What do I think of the brand? I mean, I love it. I'm loyal to it. Um, so yeah, if you, if you have the financial, if you have the financial means, just go out and get yourself one whether it be an is or an es or an rc or a gx or an lx or a ux might be my least favorite one is a ux because i don't like the cpt transmission but go out and get yourself a lexus 
drive a nice, reliable vehicle. Okay, everything from the stitching, they were just explaining to us how the vehicles are made. Every little detail from the stitching. I mean, look at the steering wheel. Look at the stitching on this thing. I mean, it's no joke. Everything is detail oriented. That's how a luxury car should be. So, uh, am I going to keep buying Lexuses? Of course I will. In fact, Lexus should probably send me some cool gifts for giving this nice promotion to them. Um, but we'll see what happens. Some swag, some shirts, you know, uh, just for having social share, make this put. But I'm not doing this for the gifts. I'm doing this because I truly enjoy cars. I'm a car guy in the auto industry for 20 years. So with that being said, go out, get yourself a Lexus, you know, level up so that you can afford one of these beautiful pieces of machinery and, you know, get a nice luxury, reliable vehicle so that your family can be safe. And um, that's it, man. So yeah, uh, thank you to Lexus for having this. I want to check out that Lexus performance driving school i might have to make a little vacation trip out of that just so i can invest a couple grand and, and do a little bit of fun performance driving um this is part of their pitch here i understand it i respect it love the hustle but yeah man uh, lexus for life all right i love lexus that's that and i love you guys too i'll see you at the very top